It's about time. Time Magazine selected Pope Francis to be its man of the year. He had some tough competition. The mad leaker Edward Snowden was said to be near the top of the list. Miley Cyrus, the infamous twerker, was another contender. But in its eternal wisdom, Time decided to go with the Holy Father. Wise selection. Francis has caused quite a stir in his short time as pontiff. He told his church brethren to stop completely fixating on politically explosive social issues like gay marriage and abortion and start focusing a bit on perennial Jesus favorites like helping the poor. He came out against trickle-down economics and that made a noted theologian Rush Limbaugh so angry he called the Pope a Marxist. He should tell that to the actual Marxists in South America who didn't particularly care for Francis before he became Francis. I think it is a mistake to think of this Pope in conventional political terms. Pope Francis is not a Democrat, he's not a Republican. I don't know if he's personally conservative or liberal, but I do know that he's been an inspiration to me and a breath of fresh air to a church that desperately needed it. Sometimes politics and ideology gets in the way of simple goodness, which this world needs a lot more of. Pope Francis reminds us that there's a whole world outside of politics, and we should all take a few moments to remember that fact, especially during this Christmas season.